Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jessica Smith. Today I'm going to be making a college decision video because I already made my college decision like a month ago. Most people know where I'm going, like my family and my friends, but I wanted to share with everyone. So, yeah. so I'm making this video because I want you guys to know where I'm going to be for the next four years. I want you guys to be in tune with my life. You know, I want to get a little personal with my YouTube channel. So, yeah. So, I'm going to tell you guys what school I'm going to and why and why the decision I made was best for me. Okay, so first I'm going to... <laughs> first, I'm going to talk about this college process in general. And it was mad stressful. Like, oh, I'm glad it's over with. Even though it's not over with, but I'm glad... You know i got certain things out the way so first it's like i applied to all these schools i applied to jefferson la salle villanova temple university delaware state morgan state university of delaware um seton hall where else did i apply i think i applied to um william patterson Delaware State, St. Joseph. I applied to all my schools early action as well. So from August to like October, like early action. So I was a, a head of the game, you know what I'm saying? Like I was on it, especially with Temple. I applied to the applications opened up and I was applying, I wasn't playing. But the stressful part was getting the FAFSA done and really narrowing down what schools I wanted to go to. And you know, when you have people in your ear saying, oh, you should go here, you should go there. It just makes it even harder. Cause I'm a, I'm a, I'm the type of person that tries to please everyone, especially like my mom and my dad. Okay, so mind you, I applied to all these schools. I got accepted into every one of them. But the main school was Temple. I always wanted to go to Temple. So I get my exception letters back and when it came to Temple, they told me I got accepted online before I got anything in the mail. And when I got accepted, all I seen was, congratulations, you were accepted um, into health professions. And y'all, my major is nursing. I applied in the nursing program of Temple and all the other schools I applied to. So, the typical situation was an iffy story because I had applied to the nursing program, then something happened to where my application didn't go to the nursing program and I knew something was up when on the portal thing, it wasn't saying nursing and I kept calling. And every time they would tell me, oh, you're fine, you're fine. And then when it came down to me getting my exception, it was, oh, you didn't even apply to nursing. So then it was this whole process. I had to wait and see if I can get in a nursing program because my application didn't go there so they had to send my application to the nursing program and then boom i'm waiting all this time and then unfortunately someone reaches out to me and he's like it's too late to change your major so it's like okay i was decided to go to that school but then i can't be a nurse why would i go to the school if i can't do what i really want to do you feel me so that was like a bummer but what am i going to do I'm gonna pick another school. So then I was thinking about University of Delaware. So listen, my brother plays football for the University of Delaware. If I went there, it would be cool. My brother goes there. But I don't really know too much about that school. That was kind of like a, oh, cause my brother goes there. And I was thinking like, it's cool, but where do I really wanna go? So then I find out that they didn't put me in the nursing program either. Mind you, these schools are really top notch, but it's also like my grades are good. So I'm not even knowing why I'm not getting in the nursing program. They keep putting me right under the nursing program, which is kind of strange, but there's nothing I can do. It's just crazy also how you always think, oh, you think of your dream school and you think you're gonna go to your dream school. And sometimes that's just not how it works. It sometimes it just doesn't play out like that you know what i mean and it's sad at first but then i start thinking like hmm if god wanted me to go to that school i was going to that school 
And like I said before, I want to be a nurse. I'm going to be an RN when I graduate from college. That's the plan. And I always wanted to be a nurse. So it's like, why go to a school where I can't do what I want to do if I already know what I want to do? I know a lot of people go to college just to go to college and they find themselves while they're in college. But I, it's like, I already know what I want to do. So let me show y'all this um, acceptance letter from Temple, right? And I have wrote nursing program on there because I was trying to manifest it because this is when I was trying to figure out if they were going to allow me to go in the nursing program. So I'm really praying on it and stuff. It didn't work out. Then we have University of Delaware. This was kind of like, mm, I don't know. It's a cool school. I've been there because my brother goes there, like I said, but I don't really know too much about it. But even on this, I, I would be like a nutrition major or something. Not even nurse major, which that's the goal. Then LaSalle. LaSalle put me in the nursing program. So then we have Morgan State, which is in Baltimore. And I got accepted into the nursing program as well at Morgan State. So it was Morgan State and LaSalle. I had to figure out which one I wanted to go to. So I started thinking like, okay, LaSalle has... A basketball team but they don't have a football team i don't want to go to school where i have a football and a basketball team we're gonna say it's an hbcu and i do want to experience the hbcu the sal is closer so it was kind of like oh decision decision of course my family wanted me to be close they want me to go to la salle they really wanted me to go to temple but they know like that wasn't really in the picture anymore so it was more so we have la salle and we have morgan state which one do y'all really think that I'm going to pick. We have closer, then we have, you know, a more lit area, further away, new experiences, new people. Then we have close to home, not too far, making family happy, but not so sure. Scared to go here, but excited. Know I'll be good if I go here, but don't know if I really wanna go here. What, like, you know, what do I pick? So, which college did I pick? Let me tell you how I didn't pick any college. I'm not even going to college. Just kidding. Psych, guys. I picked. Ready? Drum roll, please. Morgan State. I'm going to be a Morgan State bear so i'm excited about that and at this point my family's excited for me too it's only two hours away from where i live that's not far at all y'all so yeah i'm going to morgan state also my best friend is going to morgan state we're going to be dorming together we're going to be lit and i can't wait but you know i'm going there to be a nurse like i really want to stay on top of my work all that and i ended up choosing morgan state because i feel like it will be good for me. I'm getting away. I'm meeting new people. I'm meeting new area. Baltimore is full of different things. Like, it's way different than Jersey. Like, I've been to Baltimore once, but I know it's, like, real... What's the word? I heard it was real lit out there. So, I'm hoping to, you know, grow my social media, I'm grow my YouTube channel, and really, you know, become a better version of myself out there in Baltimore and I'm really excited y'all but yeah that's my college decision and I did this for that's my college decision and I did that for me nobody else I had to explain that to I actually I didn't have to explain that to anyone because as long as I know I'm happy in my decision and like I said I really wanted to go to Temple and that was the plan but everything happens for a reason so now it's more to say at first, my mom thought, oh, because Danielle was my best friend is going to Morgan State. But it's like, no. I wanted to, I started thinking like, oh, maybe everything's happened for a reason. Like, if I'm starting to think of Morgan State all of a sudden, maybe it's because I should be experiencing more things. I can go to Baltimore. I can see things. It could be better opportunities for my YouTube channel. Like, you just don't know. Like, everything happens for a reason. Maybe Temple didn't happen for a reason. So... 
something's telling me to go to Morning State. But then my peoples were stressing me out because, of course, they're trying to make me not go. And they were saying, like, oh, like, Baltimore is the hood and you're going to be far. You know, you're going to want to come home, blase, blase. So it was kind of like my head was spinning. And then, of course, at this point, Danielle was already excited because, like, we're best friends. We're going to college together. We're going to room together and all that. So, yeah, it's an HBCU. Like I said, it's in a area where I can develop more. Um, I definitely feel comfortable that I'm going to be with someone from home because I'm not going to lie. Um, I'm really close to my family and I am going to miss them being two hours away. I'm not used to being away from my family, but I'll have Danny, which is my bestie. So I'll be good. And yeah, I'm just really excited. And like I said, I'm confident in my decision and I can't wait. I just can't wait to start new. So that was my college decision. Comment down below what college you guys go to, what college you want to go to, your dream school or whatever. And don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, stay tuned for my next video.